This is a short video on how to use the Obelisk Top 2 Windows software. When you open the Windows software, you'll need to select the timer that you have, in which case it's TR Top 2, and most cases it'll be the TR622 Top 2, and then hit OK. The program will come up with a blank screen. You should save the blank screen as a file before you start to put your times in. Now, Channel 1 is the bells. Channel 2 is the music. So select Channel 1, click on New, Pulse. On, the first bell will be 9 o'clock a.m. and will ring on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and will ring for 10 seconds. The second bell, which will be an on bell, will ring at 11 15 and ring on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday for 10 seconds. The next bell will ring at 11 45 on five days a week for 10 seconds. The next bell ring at 12 o'clock Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday for 10 seconds. Once you have all your bells programmed your screen should look something like this. For example we have all our daily bells programmed here but we have four extra bells programmed on Friday for scripture which ring for four seconds instead of ten seconds. Now we can program our music. Music is programmed with separate on and off times. As you can see, switch on 9.10, Monday to Friday. Switch off 9.12, Monday to Friday. So the music will switch on at 10 past 9 and switch off again at 12 past 9. And so on. On again at 12.05, off again at 12.07, on again at 2.30, off again at 2.32. When you're happy with all your times the way they are, you should save the file. Once you're happy with all the times on the computer it is time to load those times onto the obelisk card using your USB device. Connect the USB to any USB port on your computer. The light will light up on the unit. Take the card from the timer and plug it into the box. Now when you're ready to save the times, look up and you will find a green arrow pointing towards a shape which looks like the card. Press this, and if you wish to overwrite the existing data, which you normally do, press yes. The red light on the box will light up, indicating that the times are being written to the card. When the red light goes out, the card has been written, and you may remove the card and then go to the timer and load the times into the timer from the card. 